Cause you call me by my name The love you give me Cause you call me by my name The love you give me I just can't deny Yeah, No longer blinded I can see you I'm on my way to meet you We gotta talk, you know All these trials and tribulations Got me tired, I need rest And I heard that I can come to you When weary of my flesh You awaken me from death God, I need you Hi guys Welcome back This is gonna be a day in a life Of a single mom uh, My name is Kenya I go by Kenya, Colleen, whatever you guys wanna call me I am a daughter of the Most High. If you guys are new to my channel, welcome. I'm so glad that you guys are here. Go ahead and like and um, subscribe on my in my channel so you guys can be a part of this fellowship that we got going on. Um, like so, just I'm like, okay. Anyway, so I don't know what I want to say, but right now it's currently 6:57. I am at the gym, so I um I go to this little neighborhood gym. And the only way I can go in there if they are open. So I went yesterday and they were open. So I'm going to assume they're open right now. OMG. So I was going to take my pre-workout, but I don't see it. All right. So right now I'm going to take my pre-workout. I took this yesterday. Um, this was my first time taking it. And I think it was pretty good. So, um... It's a, it's a stimulant. It's the Oxy Shred. The reason why I got the Oxy Shred was because I've heard a lot of good things about it. And specifically, I wanted a fat burner. And that's what the Oxy Shred is. It's apparently, it's like a pre-workout with a fat burner. Who knows? And I wanted something that would make me sweat. So that's why I got it. And plus, it was on sale. Usually, this thing is $60 at the GNC store, but I got two things for $50. So, I was like, let me just get it. So, I'm just going to put it in this cup and put it in some water. They said 10 ounces of water. Um, I It tastes good, don't get me wrong, but I just don't like the taste of it. Okay, I think that's enough. I should get something to mix it, but I don't have anything. So I'm just going to roll it around. It says take 10 minutes before you work out. So today, um, I think today is going to be another ab day. I really liked doing abs yesterday. So I did abs yesterday. I'm going to do it again today. I'm going to do um, cardio and abs. Yesterday, I did abs. The day before that, I did back and um, oh, I need, I need to do an arm day. I need to do an arm day, y'all. I'm gonna do ab again because this stomach, this is where my this is my problem, y'all. My stomach is the problem. Okay, so I'm just gonna go and chug this down. Cheers. It tastes like bubblegum water. That's what I don't like about it. All right, so let's go in the gym, y'all. Um, I bought this. So when, once we go in there, I'm going to go in the bathroom and put it on and put my shoes on. Like I said, I don't know if it's open, but we're going to try it. If it's not open, then we're going to have to go to Planet Fitness. And I cannot record at Planet Fitness. I don't care what anybody say. Oh, my gosh, y'all. So... I just added some new music to my workout playlist and like anyways I only listen to Christian music when I'm working out and I literally have like the best playlist so if you guys want it y'all know what to do ask down below and see whatever it is oh my gosh it's open 
is open. All right, so I forgot my headphones, so I'm about to go get it. But the reason why I like this gym is because it has literally everything. It's small, it's nice, it's aesthetic, and guess what? Like, it's only one person in there right now. So, most of the times when I come in there, it's only like one or two, three people max, including me. So that's why I love it. I just, oh, this car needs to get washed today. Oh my gosh, I'm just spending money. Can't forget about my AirPod dupe that you guys never asked for. But it's okay. God's going to bless me with my channel. And then soon y'all going to be asking. And I'm going to go gatekeep. Yep. So. <laughs> to use everything or just buy detergent because nothing will last in this house this house is full of wolves as i like to say it so i have some work clothes in here so i use a lot of detergent so i can get clean and i want it to smell good oh my gosh princess i'm coming I wanted to make her a bottle before we were going to Publix. Karen is here. She's finally here. So I wanted to make her a bottle, but let me make her a bottle. Oh, it's currently 12.30. Me and Chloe just took an hour and a half nap. Was well, supposed to be an hour. Turned into an hour and a half. So I'm a little behind schedule. Um, So right now I'm going to take Chloe a shower, feed her, and then fold the clothes. And then that should give me enough time to either... Go pick up the kids so let's get that on and popping hey guys back again all right so chloe took a shower she's chloe i don't know what she's doing but um i i, I get, i'm gonna give her some sauce pois. she just did some pois beans that Haitian people make and they blend it up whatever so she's gonna eat this it's not cold but i it's like it's, you know she wants it a little warm i'm gonna oh it's hot Early. all right so i'm gonna take some of this hot water it's gonna be for me i'm gonna just drink a little bit of something i'm gonna show you all what i'm making i'm gonna put this in here so it can just warm up so in the meantime i bought these pills yesterday this is the carcina l-carnitine this is supposed to help with weight management um appetite control and fat metabolism so basically it's like a fat burner and the appetite control that because i get too hungry 
So you're supposed to swallow two pills before, like 30 minutes before you eat. I didn't take it this morning, but I'm gonna take it now. Um, I'm not gonna eat, I'm just gonna take it. I don't know if I should wait. Oh well, I will see if it works or not. So first of all, I don't know how to swallow pills. This is way too big for me. So I'm gonna put it in the drink. So I'm gonna let it dissolve in the hot water. Put, okay, I put some ginger. Then I put just a teaspoon of honey, just 60 calories. Then I'm gonna squeeze half a lemon and put it in there. Yes. I'm, I'm gonna put this shirt on because I just took her shower and stuff and she will get herself dirty or I will, whoever does. But I'm just gonna leave it like this. Okay, sit down, stay still. Here, you wanna eat? Eat. Eat it. I don't want to hear. I don't want to see a face. All right, y'all. So I was gonna go get my car clean, but I forgot my car at home, and they don't take Apple Pay, so I'm just not gonna do it now. Um, I'm at the KJ's bus stop. It take um, it's 1:51, and the bus come at 2:23, so I have some time. I did laundry, I washed the bottles, I took away shower, I fed her, so I'm gonna get into the word. Even though I'm going to Bible study today, I am gonna read my Bible. I am in First Samuel. You know, we're talking about these dang Israelites. I, I haven't read a chapter yet where the Israelites are not in trouble. Literally. So what's happening? So First Samuel, let's see what happened. When I first was reading the book, it was about Hannah, she wanted a baby. She cried to God. God gave her a son. And she said that if you give me a son, I promise to give him back to you. And I th what's his name? Samuel. I forgot. I think his name is Samuel. So ever since Samuel was born, he has been serving the Lord. So, you know, and everybody knew that he was a true prophet of God. He was a man of God. And long story short, but Hannah, even though she asked for one kid, God gave her five. So, um, you know, they, he lived his life serving God. And then, you know, the Israelites, you know how they are. Um, they asked for a king. And they had the judges. Samuel kids were the judges of wherever the place was at. And they were really greedy. Nobody liked them. They weren't like Samuel at all. So the Israelites was asking for a king. And God said, you know what? Y'all want a king? Get a king. Why Why y'all need a king? I, You know, they, since y'all want a king, y'all got it. Because y'all putting y'all faith in something else instead of putting y'all faith in me. So, um, anyways, so God gave them a king. I, I forgot the man's name. His name is David. He's taller than everybody else. Is it David or is it Saul? I don't remember the names, but God gave him a king. He's very handsome, very tall. Um, and they're, they've been going through the war. I think they're fighting with some people. The Phil I don't know who they're fighting with. But um, I think that's where I stopped. Where the king disobeyed. Whatever. I'm, I'm, I'm going to go see what it is. The Holy Bible. Let's see what it was talking about. Yo, that was the king. And Saul was the son of Hannah. Who... Um, <clears throat> Who was the man of God that everybody knew that he was the man of God? No, that was Samuel. Okay, Samuel is the son of Hannah. And and Saul was the new king of Israel, wherever the heck they was. Yeah, the Philistines. They was in war with the Philistines. All right, well, I'm gonna get into the word, y'all, and I'll see y'all later. I'm supposed to meet somebody there tonight. Not a boy, a girl. Um, one of my friends put me on because I don't really have friends that go to that church, so she's gonna put me on. So I don't know if I'm gonna. I already know. She, uh, well, she told me that she'll be the one wearing a mask. So I don't know if I'm gonna approach her or not because I'm really nervous. Um, so Karen is going to come with me, and then if I approach her, I approach her. If not, I don't. So yeah i am going to sit in the car and wait for care bear so um i'm telling you my car needs to go to the shop 
so it was raining really bad today because there's a hurricane up north up in north florida but it did not hit <laughs> all right so i am i'm taking a break from lashes i haven't worn lashes in two weeks so um, i need to like learn what i love what i look like without lashes and like a natural look so that's why i kind of did this hair because i'm trying to like get myself in a natural state um of like loving myself without the wigs and stuff so the next time i'm going to be putting a wig on is going to be september 24th i have the church gala so i'm gonna be going i'm gonna go all out for that because i just don't never go nowhere i never got nothing to do so yeah Oh, this. Oh. Bro, ice cold water is really the key to life. Well, no, I'm not going to say that. I'm sorry, Lord. Ice cold water is really the key to staying hydrated because, but that's only if you like ice cold water. Me, I love me some ice cold water. I would drink ice cold. I want to be in ice cold water. So that's why I got this. But when I take this to work, I need a little cap over it. So I need to go to Walmart. Hopefully Karen will go to Walmart with me so I can um, buy Chloe some baby water and see if I can get a little cap for this. I don't know if they're gonna have that at Walmart. Oh, the water almost done. Cause I put so much ice in here. I got some water, I'm gonna add. All right, like I said, we just waiting on camera. nothing new all right guys so i decided that once i get to my goal weight which is 160 pounds 155 then i will go on a shopping spree um on fashion over on any site and get myself a whole new wardrobe but um did karen give me ice where's my ice i told her to bring me some ice anyways yeah so that's gonna be my gift to myself i was gonna buy my i'm, I'm trying i'm definitely gonna buy my camera before the gala because i definitely mm, actually i might not hold up where's the ice oh, okay. she yelled at me for um yelling at her all right y'all i will see y'all later honestly y'all i mean i will show you guys a little bit of bible study but i don't think i can record it's so much people there like young people too it actually people of all ages <laughs> all right y'all it's time to go to bed bible study was amazing as always karen is eating her food i don't know anyways y'all it's time to go to bed it's currently 10 p.m i'm going to work tomorrow so this will be the end of this vlog this is the day of my life you can give me her <laughs> Cleo, Cleo. girl me and Cleo was talking for the longest i'm like telling Chloe, mama mama she is hard down repeating dada Stop touching stuff. And she ain't say a lick of a mm. She don't want to say my name. Anyways, y'all, just put these press-ons on. Because the ones I had before, I didn't like it. But I want to say thank you guys for Mama. anybody who supports my... Excuse me? What did you say? Mama. 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 <laughs> Anyways, y'all.